With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So in this question we have considered two containers A and B containing identical gases at the same pressure, volume and temperature. The gas in container A is compressed to half its original volume isothermally like while the gas in container B is compressed to half its original value adiabatically. Okay. The ratio of final pressure of gas in B to that of gas in A is. So we have to calculate the final pressure uh, for gas A and B and uh, have to calculate the ratio between that. Okay. Now what we are given is um, gas A right gas a is isothermal right isothermal processes so for an isothermal gas i can say that p1 v1 that is equal to p2 v2 right uh, so from here so from here p2 that is final pressure this will be equal to p1 v1 upon uh, v2 right this is final pressure for gas a okay now also in the question we are given that the gas in container A is compressed to half its original volume isothermally. So if V2 is final pressure, then uh, this will be equal to half of initial pressure V1, right? So I can replace this uh, in this equation. I will get P, P1 V1 upon V1, right? Multiplied by 2, right? So this will be equal to P2A. This will be equal to 2 P1. Okay, this is P1. Let's say this is equation 1. Okay, now here gas B is compressed adiabatically. Okay, to again half its original volume. Right, this means uh, again for adiabatic, that means gas B adiabatic. Here this will be equal to P1 V1 raised to the power gamma P2 V2 raised to the power gamma. Right and again v2 will be equal to half of v1 right so from here um, p2 p2 for gas b this will be equal to p1 v1 raised to the power gamma upon uh, v2 raised to the power gamma right so i can write as p1 v1 upon v2 raised to the power gamma and this will be equal to p1 uh, v, v2 is uh, v1 by 2 right so this will be equal to v1 upon v1 into 2 raised to the power gamma okay this will get cancelled so p1 2 raised to the power gamma okay this is p2 for gas b okay now let's say this is equation 2 and we have to calculate the ratio for final final pressure of gas in B to that of gas A. Okay. This means P2 P2 of gas B upon P2 of gas A. From equation 1 and 2, I can write as P1 uh, 2 raised to the power gamma upon this will be 2P1. Right. So 2 p1 this will get cancelled and i can write this as 2 gamma raised to the power minus 1 right so this will be the required ratio that means correct option is option a for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today